A friend recently asked me, Jamal, you talk a lot about being aware and observing, but what's the difference between observing something the way it is, a person, a situation, versus judging that person? What's the difference? Because sometimes you can observe negative things in a person, in a situation, quote unquote negative things. How do you tell the difference between judgment and simply observing or observation? I thought that was a fantastic question. Do you know the difference? Well, we've been programmed from day one. Most of us have been programmed, especially if you grew up in a religious family or grew up in some kind of religious system. And, and not even that, uh, our society is a very judgmental society. We, we are constantly making evaluations about a person's appearance, about a person's uh, manner of what they're doing, how they're speaking, all kinds of things. And we're constantly judging things to be either good or bad, things that should be this way or shouldn't be this way. Those are constant judgments. Judgments are toxic for you. The reason they're toxic is they put you in resistance to this moment, to this person, to this situation. That's where you live. The life you live is in this moment. Judgment puts you in dis-ease. It takes you out of ease and puts you into a state of dis-ease, which can affect you at the level of the body and the mind and your, your, your spirit, your energy field. So it's a very detrimental, very serious problem. Judgment is a very serious issue. Chances are you've been afflicted by it. So here's the question. How do you know or what is the difference between an observation and judgment? Are you ready? Are you ready for this difference? Yeah. The main difference between judgment and observation is this. You can make, you can observe anything. You can observe, quote unquote, even negative situations. But the moment you judge, you are no longer able to be present and enjoy that person, that situation that's right in front of you. See, that's the goal of life, is to have this life. In order to have this life, you must be able to enjoy this life. And in order to enjoy it, you must be in a state of non-resistance, which means non-judgment. Judgment is resistance. The moment you judge, you are no longer able to appreciate and enjoy that person, that situation. Have you learned how to live your life from a state of observation without judgment? I invite you to get on my mailing list. Go to my website, jamaljavanji.com, scroll to the bottom, put your email address in there, click submit, and we'll keep the conversation going. It's important you do that. Take care.